It's another big day in the COVID-19 vaccine rollout all across the country. Our 16 and 17 year olds now eligible for that vaccine. And we're really going to start seeing those shots go into those younger arms today. Uh, here to talk about that is uh, epidemiologist uh, Dr. Becky Dawson from Allegheny College, Erie News Now contributor. We always appreciate you taking time out of your morning to uh, uh, chat with us. Becky, good morning. Let's talk about the significance of the shots uh, for 16 and 17 year olds as far as the overall pandemic fight goes. How important is this? So this is super important, especially as we enter kind of three critical periods. One is just whether we kind of go indoors, lots of indoor activities right now. Second is the holidays. We're going to be mixing and getting together with friends and family that we might not see throughout the year. And then I think third is most important that we have a new variant in the midst of really high case numbers. So boosting that immune system prior to all of these things happening is really key for everyone. And now it's important for our 16 and 17 year olds. Well, let's talk about that added level of protection. The booster is obviously going out to adults for a while now, but as far as the science goes, how protective is that extra dose? So what the extra dose is going to do, it's going to, I can remind your immune system that, you know, it's seen the SARS-CoV-2 virus before, that it knows how to fight it if it comes in contact with it. And I think really important as our hospitals fill up, this vaccine is really good at keeping people from getting severely ill and needing that hospitalization. And uh, that's probably part of what your, uh, your reasoning is for encouraging the younger kids to get the shots. We know that uh, some of the younger cases in, or the cases of uh, COVID in some of the younger patients really don't come with the most severe symptoms. So for the folks who may be hesitant to get themselves or their kids vaccinated, uh, why would you be encouraging them to do that if the, if the symptoms really aren't that severe amongst the younger uh, generation? Yeah, so two reasons. I think number one is that, you know, COVID is a disease that's sort of like roulette. You know, most of the time people don't get those, you know, severe symptoms, but sometimes they do. And we don't have a predictive model right now that would explain why someone would get those severe symptoms and need hospitalizations and somebody else wouldn't. So you're kind of playing a game of roulette, whereas the vaccine provides sustained immunity almost for 100% of people, you know, we're in the upper 90s. I think also it's really important that your vaccine doesn't just protect you, it protects others, it provides that herd or population level immunity. That's so important when you're fighting an infectious disease such as COVID-19. Dr. Becky Dawson, epidemiologist with Allegheny College and Erie News Now contributor, we thank you so much for your time this morning. We'll see you soon. Bye-bye. All right, we're going to check David's first warning.